Draw the World by Catherine Chambers Contents Introduction 2. A pattern from India 4. A style of Arabic script 6. Australian dreamtime art 8. African patterns 10. Egyptian frieze art 12. Native American bead patterns 14. Japanese woodblock print 16. Chinese painting 18. Indonesian batik cloth 20. World art map 22. Glossary 23. Art all around us The world is full of patterns and pictures. Some we see every day. Some are new to us. We can copy pictures and patterns. We have to look very carefully to copy something well. So pick up your pencils and draw the world. A pattern from India. Look carefully at the patterns drawn on these Indian elephants. The elephants are at a festival. Now you draw. Draw a circle. Use a cup to draw the circle and help shape the curves. You can draw spots, stripes or zigzags inside the circles. An Arabic script. The blue lines on these tiles are Arabic script. Now you draw. This word means lily flower. Copy it. Move your pen from right to left to make the lines. Make the lines and curves thinner at the ends. Draw the dots as diamond shapes. Australian Dreamtime Art Ancient stories in Australia tell how plant and animal spirit shaped the world. Artists marked these stories on rock, bark, cloth or paper. Look at the dots all around the shape of the lizard. Now you draw. Draw a lizard and make patterns over its body. Then paint lines of dots, stripes or waves around the body. African patterns. East African women wear bright cloths. The patterns are printed around a square border or in the centre. Now you draw. Make a black border around your paper. Draw bold black teardrop or zigzag shapes and colour them brightly. Fill the border or centre with the coloured shapes. Egyptian frieze art. These pictures, patterns and symbols are used to tell stories. Ancient Egyptians painted them on walls of palaces and tombs. Now you draw. Take a strip of paper. Draw patterned borders along the top and bottom. Fill the middle of the paper with a story or information. Draw the figures and symbols. You could also cut out pictures from magazines and comics. Then stick them in. Native American bead patterns. Tiny beads are threaded together to make patterns. The band of beads is then sewn on to an animal skin bracelet. Now you draw. Use a ruler and pencil to draw small squares onto paper. Decorate the squares in triangles, diamonds or simple stripes. Japanese woodblock print. Pictures can be made by printing. The shape of this mountain in Japan was cut into a block of wood. The wood was then painted and stamped onto paper or cloth. Now you draw. Copy and colour the triangle on white paper to create the mountain. Draw around your clouds and snow with a dark pencil or paint. Chinese painting. Artists in China use brushes and watery inks on paper or silk. The light brush strokes give movement. Now you draw. Draw a fish with a curved body. Make it look like it is swimming. 
Add an eye and fins. Make the fins in the shape of triangles or squares. Paint large swirls with watery paints or pens to make waves. Indonesian batik cloth. A batik artist draws wax patterns onto cloth. The wax stops the patterns from changing colour when the cloth is dyed. Now you draw. Use a wax candle to draw a pattern. Now colour your piece of paper all over with wet pens or paints. The wax pattern stays. World map. Glossary. Border. Strip around the edge of something for decoration. Curves. Line that bends round like part of a circle. Festival. Special day or period when people celebrate something. Script. Set of letters used for writing a particular language. Swirls. Twisting circular patterns. Zigzags. Line that changes direction from left to right and back again at sharp angles.